lovelies. So today I am going to get my tattoo done and it's gonna go right here and I'm really excited. And I don't know if I'm gonna be able to actually record at the tattoo parlor because I just called them and the dude said that we would have to talk about it more when I got there. So if I can film, I'll include that here. If not, then I'll include other stuff. Um, at the very least, I'll have pictures that I can put up. Um, but I am i can't express how excited I am to get this tattoo. I've literally been wanting this tattoo for like five years and it, ugh, I'm finally gonna get it done and I'm so happy. <laughs> but um, yeah, so that's what's going on today. Hello, so we're at the tattoo parlor now. The Breeze here now. Hello. So we're gonna get this tattoo done. I keep trying to play with my necklace, it's not there. Um, but the artist told me that he feels a little bit uncomfortable on camera, so I don't want to record anything of him actually tattooing me, but I'll be able to give updates of like what the stencil looks like and like what the outline looks like and things like that. So also, I am like his only appointment for the day, so we'll be able to hang out and basically get this done completely today, I think. I hope. <laughs> so. Yeah. I'm super nervous. I don't know why, but I am. But it's so cute, you guys. It's so cute. It's like cuter than the actual design that I showed you in the last video. It's so adorable and it fits so perfect. It's so good. But. I'll show you the outline as soon as he gets it done and I can do it in the mirror, but. Outline's done, so all we've got to do now is just the color. Oh my god, I love it so much! Oh, I'm so happy! Oh my god, guys, look at this! We're taking a little bit of a break right now, but look at how cute it already looks! Oh, I love it so much! Hey, I'm not gonna be able to express that in one video how much I love this tattoo. Oh. We're back again, and. Oh, look! Okay, so we're, I am at my limit for today. So this is all we're gonna be able to do for right now. But he added a little highlight like right there for the where Tattle was gonna be like shining on his face. So we've gotta finish up the fairies and the vines and then a little bit of like highlighting here and there. It's so cute though. I absolutely love this. All right, so it is the next day and my tattoo still looks really good. Look at him, look at how cute he is. So I love it very much. And today I am going to get a treatment to put on it that I have to leave on it for five days, I think. He's gonna give me a rundown of the instructions again when I get there, but I've gotta leave in just a couple of minutes to go get this treatment done. Um, but he told me that when I take the treatment off, that um, the tattoo should be like basically healed, um, if I remember correctly. I could be wrong and I might update you when I get it done. But, so that's what I remember him saying. But, so I'm excited. Ugh, I can't believe I finally have this tattoo. Like it has been a huge dream of mine to have this tattoo done for five years. And I finally have it on my body it's so perfect. It's so perfect. Like I cannot, I cannot think of a better way to do this tattoo. It's so cute. <laughs> I'm so in love with it. All right, so to wrap up this video, I'm gonna kind of talk about like my experience with this tattoo parlor a little bit. The first thing that like I, I, I guess I can talk about is like the atmosphere of the place. Everybody there is super friendly. I walked in the door and immediately felt super comfortable with everybody there. Everybody's really friendly, everybody's really kind, um, they talk to you. So my, when I was getting my tattoo done, like not only the artist that was working on it was like excited for me that I was like getting this tattoo that I've wanted for so long, um, 
but like everybody else that like artists there and stuff were coming up and you know being like oh, I'm so excited to see this when it's done I'm so excited to see this when it's done and like that made me feel good because not only does the artist care about their work but the other artists in the place care about everybody's work so that's just a really good like atmosphere I think I guess going along into that like while I was laying there getting my tattoo done um, unfortunately I couldn't like show any of this because um, Tommy was not comfortable being on camera, which I 100% understand and I respect, which is why all of the clips were me in the mirror by myself. But while we were laying there, we were just talking the whole time. He was super comfortable, you know, with, with us and like we just chatted about all kinds of different stuff. He was super friendly to us. Another thing too, like, I didn't feel like he was trying to do everything that he could to get the most money out of me, if that makes sense. He was very fair with his pricing. His pricing made a lot of sense to me. And so, it so like I explained in the vlog when I was going to talk to them about getting the tattoo, the first tattoo I ever got, which is right here on the front of my hip, it was kind of small. It's not nearly as big as this one. This one's already had three-ish hours of work into it. The other tattoo that I, the first tattoo that I got only had like two hours, an hour and a half, something like that in it and it was completely done. Um, and the guy wanted to charge me like $180 for it, <clears throat> which I thought was, I, I had never had a tattoo, so I thought that was like normal. So that's why I was like really surprised when he told me it wasn't going to be as expensive as I thought it was going to be, because I was expecting upwards of, you know, $300 for this tattoo. And it wasn't, it wasn't nearly as, as much as I thought it was going to be. Another thing that, um, made me really happy about being able to work with Tommy is because he, so I want this tattoo to kind of start off like um, a sleeve um, eventually. I would love to have a full sleeve, but we'll see <laughs> how we can get there. As soon as I mentioned that I wanted this to be the first part of a full sleeve, he was like, oh yeah, we can, we can do that. And I was like, all right, cool. And so while we were sitting there, I was talking about, Brie was looking at tattoo stuff as well. And so she had mentioned she has a tattoo on her arm um, that's just eyelashes. She wants it to be a little bit less girly, so she was trying to figure out ways to make it less girly. And like we were discussing it between ourselves and then he kind of like looked at it and was like, yeah, you know, you could maybe do this or maybe do that. I don't know how you would, you know, actually go about making it less girly, but he kind of put in a little bit of his own stuff as well. So I guess that just goes into the fact that he was super friendly with us while we were there. But like I can't say enough about how like grateful I am that I was able to find these people because I have absolutely loved this tattoo experience. This has been the best tattoo I've ever gotten all the way around. Um, I am super, I, I have it covered up right now because it's got the treatment on it and it looks a little bit gross. <laughs> so I didn't want to show it on camera but um, as soon as it heals up you best believe I'm going to be like showing it off to everyone and every, every day. Um, <laughs> cause I cannot express how grateful I am that I, that I'm finally able to get this tattoo and I'm finally, I was able to get it done by somebody who was so professional and so friendly and just has been super helpful through this whole process. Like he, he didn't just ramble off the instructions and then leave me at that. Like he actually was like, okay, this is what you do, and then he repeated himself and he answered any questions that I had, and then when I went to go get the treatment, which was actually the next day, he repeated the instructions to me again and answered more questions that I had, even though I'm sure that I had made him repeat himself several times. He was still super, you know, like, yeah, I can answer that question. So, um, actually, if any of y'all wanted to know where I went to go get my tattoo done, it was here. Um, Tommy Lee is the guy that did the tattoo, so this is just his card, but this place, Ambition Tattoo, is where I went to go get the tattoo done, and all of the people there are super friendly, and they have, like, piercers and stuff as well. So if any of y'all are in the Knoxville area, check out Ambition Tattoo. I cannot say enough good things about them. They're, they're just so good. Um, <laughs> but I'm definitely going to be going back to them to get other stuff done as well, because I, I like to get, like, a couple piercings and more tattoos and stuff so <laughs> but I guess that's gonna about do it for this video if you have any suggestions for 
videos you'd like to see in the future, leave those in the comments below. Or if you just want to say hi, leave a comment with that. Um, <laughs> if you want to see more stuff like this, then go ahead and hit subscribe. Um, and if you like the video, give it a big thumbs up. Until next time, stay magical, my friends.